Johnson & Johnson just released some data about the effectiveness of a booster shot. The company reported the second dose generates a big spike in antibodies to help protect people from the virus. Here's Jonathan Sari with more. Johnson & Johnson reports a booster dose of its COVID-19 vaccine generates a strong immune response. The drug maker says people who received the additional shot saw a ninefold increase in antibody levels compared to one month after their first dose. J&J &J says it's in discussions with the FDA and CDC about the need for offering a booster of its vaccine. Public health officials are currently developing a booster strategy for Americans who received Pfizer's or Moderna's vaccine. We will mobilize the unprecedented level of federal support we have provided states, pharmacies, and other partners. The announcement comes as more people roll up their sleeves to get their initial shots. The White House says daily numbers of Americans getting their first dose increased 70 percent since mid-July. Vaccination rates also rose in states that were lagging behind, such as Alabama, Arkansas, and Louisiana. The vaccines are still protecting against death and hospitalization, which we're seeing a rise of both. There is a renewed urgency to get people vaccinated as the Delta variant spreads. Hospitals in larger cities say they're pulling in patients from other states, overwhelming COVID wards and intensive care units. It's still hard to wake up every day and come see this every day. And I mean, I, I, I have no doubt we're gonna survive this. We're gonna keep going. But yeah, it's hard. Here in Georgia, Governor Brian Kemp has sent members of the National Guard to assist hard hit hospitals. In Atlanta, Jonathan Seary, Fox News.